Hey guys, and welcome back to Genshin Impact. Today we're taking on the Pyro Regis Vine, and this is how you do it. You need a water hero on your team, first of all. You need a water hero, because you're going to need this to destroy the core on the boss so that you're able to actually do damage to his health bar. The core is this thing right at the bottom here. You can see it has this little health bar. Use your water hero to attack it and basically destroy it. Make sure you don't get hit by any of the fireballs that he will shoot at you. Make sure he doesn't headbutt you. Uh, right now he's doing a kind of meteor. Make sure you run towards him. Stand directly on him for that meteor to go right over you so you're safe. Once you actually destroy that first core, you can literally get your best DPS hero on your team and go to town, destroy him. Also make sure you use an element attack to attack that little thing on the left there. You can see that blooming flower. I do manage to get it, get him myself with my ultimate attack here where I just do this and it ends up destroying it anyway. Make sure you kind of destroy that. Make sure you move away from the boss before he gets up because he does do that swiping attack. I unfortunately completely forgot on this run here. But also dodge those headbutts. You'll see when he does like a like a shake and he like stands a little bit more upright, like this, like over here, he's gonna headbutt the ground. And make sure you move out the way so that you don't get hit like that. If he does this, make sure you move backwards because he's gonna do a head spin or a head swipe around himself, and he does it twice, and make sure you dodge the headbutt again as well. Once you get him down again, Literally just go to town, do some damage to his health bar yet again. By now, you should actually be able to kill him if you're strong enough. And if you have some good heroes on your team, I would have been able to kill him here. But I want to show you how his ranged, like fighting him from a ranged distance kind of works. I do not recommend it because fighting him in ranged is literally like terrible to do because it's so hard. Because of one major thing that he does is this here. When he does this, run towards him. The safest place is towards him because you can see he costs these so frequently that you, it's a nightmare to dodge. But the closer you get to him, the less frequent he costs them on you. So it's actually, it's actually just a whole general idea to stay close to this boss. Just make sure you dodge those like spin attacks that he does because he does those quite frequently. Anytime he kind of like curves his head, make sure you just turn to the side. These are the fireballs, really easy. You just literally kite them. They do follow you around. Make sure you don't run outside of the arena because he will reset and you'll have to fight him from scratch. So kind of stay in the arena. Don't let him do that head slam facing towards you because he kind of does the shock waves. It's generally a good bet to just fight him in like the inner circle, the circle that I'm running around right now. Stay on the inner side of that circle. Here is the meteorite that he does. You just have to do a element attack to kill it immediately. It's quite easy. Just use like someone like Barbara or literally anyone with an element attack directly on their attacks and you can just like one shot it. And let's go finish the boss. Let's go finish him off. We literally just have to go attack this core right over here. Take your water hero and literally just attack this a few times and dodge the head stamp there, the head stomp that thing that he does. And now it's a, just a good time to just just end the boss like you know just just end him go to go to his face and just one shot him <laughs> and that's how you do the pyro ridges fine boss in genshin impact if you guys have any questions leave them in the comments down below i do reply to every single comment that you could possibly come up with and i'll see you guys in a future video thank you so much for watching